Is he dead? I should have did EX. No. I know my combos and my SPD damage and all that. This is the optimal way to play Zangief, bro. I don't think the character is bad. I think the players are the ones that's the problem. Yo, yo, yo. What is up, YouTube? It's me, Funk. I am back. And before we even get into the video, y'all know what y'all must do. And that is like, sub, turn the post notification bell on, and comment, and then we can get into this video. But until, not until you do that, you cannot continue. You can't make it past this gate unless you do those things. So get on that so we can get into this right now. Today, we're going to be playing our main man, the big boy. The character we actually hate to play because we can't SPD. Zangief. Sand Heavy Punch Uncharged. Fix an issue in which startup would be one thing faster than move with performing in advance during wake up recovery. Crouch and Heavy Punch. Increase knockback time when the attack lands on an airborne opponent. Alright, let's see. Oh, they're in the air for a very long time. Why are they in the air that long? That's a mad long. Okay, so that's a new combo. You know, I hear a lot of Zangief players complain about this character. And that is why I decided to play him today, actually. Uh, not this broken character. I feel like V-Skill 1 would be better. But I gotta play the V-Trigger 2, you know what I'm saying? I gotta hit people with the new combos. You gotta see how it works. Ooh, footsies. Alright, health lead. This is how you play Geef. This is why Geef players don't win. Look at that. I got the health lead. Look at that. Health lead. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? You can't dash on Zangief. Uh-huh. Look, see, you don't need to ask me. See, my Zangief been ready for this. Yeah! Look at it. Look at it. Mmm, boy! What you gonna do? I got the health lead again. I don't care. See, y'all thought I was gonna lose my first match with Zangief. Look, you hear the noises? Oh my god, I was trying to listen to my the noises that outfit makes. Now I lost the health lead because of that. What are you doing, you bot? This is Zane Grief. You don't jump on Zane Grief. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, Zangief! Zangief! Zangief, bro. I told y'all the name, Zangief. Yeah, I'm not bringing Harmony today, but I'm bringing Grief. Uh-huh, yup. You going to be chef? Watch this. Hard read. Oh, no. Zangief all about hard reads. I can't be mad if I got to make hard reads with Zangief. That's what he about. All right, you going to be chef? Hard read. Hard read. Doing, boy. Nope. Nope. Can't dash. That's Zane Grief. That's a fine display of Zane Geef play right there. I must say so myself. Oh, you see the punish? You don't need to SPD with Geef, bro. I'm telling you. Look at this. I'm gonna live in food. Look at that. Oh, man. No. Oh, you can't do that reactions. Oh. Come on, this is how you play Zangief. This is optimal. This is the optimal way to play Zangief, bro. I don't think the character is bad. I think the players are the ones that's the problem. You just got to lame all these bots out. Look at that. They don't know what to do. Look at that medium punch. Look, he lost the health lead. He don't know. He's scared now. With punish, look. Mm-hmm. You don't need the big damage. You just... Nope. Reactions can't do that. Uh-huh. What you going to do? I'm Zane Grief, bro. I bring Grief to you. You're not going to keep pressuring me. Good games. Good games. 
No, you're not grabbing me either. Nah, you're not getting free damage. I don't you care. You're not grabbing me. Dad, that was one game? I feel bad for this dude. I could do this all day. Optimal Zane Grief play. You bring grief to all the people you play against. Oh, that ain't combo. Okay, I'll take that. Nice and Punish. Is he dead? Oh! Zang Grief! Bro, what? Why did Jury outfit look like this? This that new outfit, isn't it? I don't like it. Alright, let's go. Wood punish. Wood punish. Wood punish. That's an unfortunate crush counter. Punish. I take that. What? Oh, is he dead? I should have did EX. No. I know my combos and my SPD damage and all that. I'm a Zane Geek player. Take notes, Geek players. This is how you play Zane Grief. Well, Karen, you had a good life, huh? This, this is not the matchup for you, baby girl. I'm not, uh, I'm not the matchup for you, baby girl. Jab, jab, I won. All right, good game, Joe. So how's the chat feeling today? How y'all doing? How we doing today? Uh, we eating big with Punish. Uh, with Punish, what you gonna do, Karen? This is a 20 old matchup. We're punished. What you going to do? And you dropping combos? I could be in the corner. What you going to do in there? Yup, I'm going to keep. Nope. Teach Zane Geek players how to play this terrible matchup. Look at this. You don't need to do. Look at this. You don't need to do anything but this. Those two. Nope. Nope. This matchup is literally terrible. I don't even have to do that. I could do this. You press a medium button and that's it. Mm-hmm. Help lead. What she gonna do? What she gonna do? Oh, my controller came out. All right. Uh-huh. Look, see, he didn't even know my controller came out. That's how bad this matchup is. Oh, that's really GG. Can Karen get put in the corner? I don't need to take risk. That's things that Zengi players don't know. They'll try to SPD you there when you're playing Karen, but it's no need. Like, you don't have to always SPD with Zengi. Trying to teach Zangief players the optimal way. I corner someone with Zangief, unless I absolutely need to SPD them, it's no need. Why would I ever SPD Karen in the corner and give her a chance to jump? Why? Why would I do that? All right, now watch this. Watch what happens when I do nothing. I'm gonna do nothing. Watch. Let's let's see if he can win. Look at this. Uh huh. It's just display of domination. Uh, 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 uh. Ah! 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 
Nope. Look at this. No. 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 Go to school. You didn't go to school, did you? Did you? No. Ric Flair drip go. Woo! Woo! All right, but you guys know in this part of the video, we usually tell you what I think about Zangief personally and if I think he has what it takes to compete. I don't think Zangief is bad. The V-Shift might be a thing, but you know, Zangief, I feel like is a character that's you built on hard reads, right? So V-Shift is just something else you can read and get mad damage from. And I also think Zangief neutral is just amazing. You guys see the display of medium punches and jabs. You know, it might not be a lot of damage, but trust me, damage is not everything. Sometimes you just gotta get the slow damage. You gotta slow roast them. You gotta put them on a stick. You gotta spin them slowly. You gotta slow roast them sometimes. People get impatient. These bots get impatient in ranked match or in tournament too. Not just ranked match. They get impatient. And that's why Zangief is not cheap. He's not cheap, but he's not trash. You know what I'm saying? So don't listen to all them Zangief players here. Zangief is a certified punk in my book, okay? Certified punk character. Not really because I don't like grapplers, but we want to say this is a certified punk. I give him some thumbs up right now, you know what I'm saying? He's not a bad character. I don't think so. But I'll see you guys next time. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm not bringing harmony today, but I'm bringing grief.